All right, guys, we're doing a driveway here, and um, we're doing one side of the, uh, of the house because the customer uh, got a uh, notice from the HOA. So just go ahead and go ahead and clean it up for her and um, get the HOA off her back. <laughs> All right, check it out. All right, it's the driveway. Got some algae over here. A couple of little spots. doing this side of the house got some stains over here nothing major nice and easy I'm gonna be out of here real quick
job is all done. We got the driver looking pretty good. Let's check out the sides. All right, all the algae is gone. Still drying up, but it's gonna look good once it dries up. And hey, what's going on guys? Today, I'll be fixing this um, downstream injector. I had it for about five months, worked pretty good. Um, these never last, you know, forever. So um, if you rinse them out, they last you a pretty good long time, you know, but um, I didn't rinse it out the last couple of times I used it. So it stopped working. So I had to order the kit, which is just a O-ring, the ceramic ball and uh, uh, the spring. This is the EnviroSpec. Uh, this is the big uh, injector supposed to pull 3%, which is good for uh, stuck holes, good for pre-treating, post-treating. Um, I like it, you know what I'm saying? It works It works pretty good. I probably won't buy another one, but uh, I do have a couple of spare ones of the regular size ones. I got two of those, So, but this one's my main one that I use, as you can tell how it looks. So I'm gonna go ahead and open this up and um, you know get this thing back working so all you need is a, a wrench i don't think i have this thing under that tight but we'll try and see if i can take it off okay it's on that pretty tight actually let's see oh lee i don't know it's pretty snug so we gotta be careful with this. There's a spring and the ball in there. You know, of course, that's what we're changing. That's the ball. You gotta be careful when you take these things out because sometimes the spring pops out. You don't you can't even tell. I'm not even sure where it is. But anywho. So uh, with these, they come with like a few orifices, like three of them. And uh, one of them is like for two and a half to a four. One of them is from like a five to an eight. And then uh, I think another one's from eight to a 10. Is this little orifice inside right here that you can just screw inside of it. There it is. There's the oil ring. See what it looks like. Yeah, it looks yeah, it looks a little beat up right here. Just for that little beat up right there, the the ball will stick onto the O-ring and won't allow it to you know to move properly. So just that little bit right there. You stop you from working. So I'm gonna come back and put the uh, O-ring inside of here. So you put your your spring down in the middle of the injector. I think it's pretty small. Boom. Got your spring in there. Put your ball in on the top of the spring and get your little port. Put your port on. Screw it in. You don't need to go crazy on this like I did. <laughs> All right. Uh, that's in there so we're gonna go and try this out see how it works 